Well, look as if um, I am here and um, almost completed and ready to test. Except that I am seeing a little, a little bulge right here. From I need a little flange, I think, at the back here to um to even up with this flange that is between here that cause it to, to bulge a bit. Might have to put some spaces between here. But it look as if, well, it's all ready to, to furl. It's all ready to furl. Okay. It's all ready. Then I'm gonna have to put, just go some hole right there. It's a hole right there to put a, a stopper and one right here to prevent it from furling all the way back here into the blades. Right? So it's already and this is only a prototype. And there's another one, another hole right down here. So I'm gonna put two two stoppers in it from the back so that um, I will have one right here and one right here. This one will let it furl about um, a 10 degree extra and this one will go up to about um, not quite 90 degree but to prevent the tail from running up into the blade and I okay so I think that um, I'm almost there to put it up and uh, do some tests let it run and do some tests do some measurements and I'll be quite happy with the result if it's good or if it's not too good I will have to just make some more adjustment and I'm using the 24 48 volts PMG as a test and um, in a couple of days time I will um, yes I will I'm gonna um, hmm, put it up and not not gonna put it high gonna put it in a piece of pipe in the yard and make some observation so um, just got to get a piece of one and a half inch pipe and uh, a stopper in it to prevent it from going right down and I'm going to put it up and um, put it up put it up put it up put it up and let it roll and let it stay right there and do its thing there's nothing much I'm hoping for but just to to see one thing happen, to see if it can furl, to see if it will furl and furl and furl, because that is important right now. So, that's it. Hmm. That's how it's looking from the rear. Mm -hmm. And so it's looking from the back right here. A little bit of angle, a little bit of um, tilting to um, have the tail. This is this is rather straight when it's straight like that. Okay, okay. Let's see. Let's straighten it up and okay. See, okay. well, I put it that way. Okay, so when it's straight, right like that at the back. Yeah, so that. Um, even gravity will bring the tail back down and have it straighten up so it, that um, that bolt that bolt is sort of angle from the top to the bottom angle iron it's from angle from the right side to the left side so it can furl to the left and then it's angle from the top angle inwards so that gravity will swing the tail down and hold it right there.
put a stop with there anyway. But so far, putting it together, it's looking looking okay, looking okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. And this tail, it's, um, it's three feet long. I didn't cut the pipe. I bought it like that. Didn't cut it. So I'm just trying it with the tail. Mm -hmm. It could be too long, but um, as I said, it's just a, just a little child here. Just a little child. So it will fur like that. Yeah. That's how it's gonna. That's how it's fur. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, so that's it for now until until later when I have it swing up on the pipe and see what we're doing. Okay, so finally here we are. I have modified a tail or built a tail for this turbine. This is the old PMG and I have modified a tail for a test and it's up right here and this is what I have but somehow I believe that this tail is a bit heavy I think it's heavy and um, I may need to do some. it spins so this is the old PMG that um, I also changed the 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 bearings and there's a little a little bit of tightness there but um, I have no load attached to it or no wire just put it up to make sure that it was um, turning in the wind and um, it did it did so okay here we go here we go and this is my old area that they return to to just make some tests here because I don't have to climb up too high so I, um, I cut a pipe 14 feet long put it into this old dish mount and I can raise it up after I put the, the turbine on so here we go so we have some some action here but we need a lot of wind now to um we don't have a lot of wind today need a lot of wind to have it furl right now and um just to make some tests. It is sturdy, the tail is on sturdy, but um, will it furl? I don't know. I don't know if it will furl. So, here we are. Here we are. I'm just gonna observe it for the rest of the day, or leave it up there for some time, and um, it's too heavy. might be saying that prematurely I need to see it operating in a lot of wind the tail is a bit flipped there anyway the star should be above stars and stripes should be above I'll correct that Yeah, I do need a furling tail in this. If a furling tail is attached to this, it will be super. It will be super to have a furling tail in this turbine here. It will just save me some stress and um, give me some more satisfaction. To 
we have a curling tail in this. I take that back there, uh, which uh, holds a little bit in because that um, bracket behind there, um, that pipe behind there could be reinforced or just built a furling tail separately and just attach it, line it up and just attach it behind there. If I had the material and the, the right um, the right metal, right workshop, I would um, probably take some more time and come up with a design. I could do that. I see exactly what I'm craving for right now. And I'm gonna have to, um, I think I need to get that done. The mount is okay, but just a little bit, um, a little thicker metal behind there. Reinforce the back to put that mount on. To support the, that kind of tail there. Yeah, I could see that um, that's what I would need right now. Some reinforcement, a better design um, mount. Put it behind there and it will be rocking the waist. Heavy wind I need to have so I could see it a bit so I said that pipe is a bit rocky pipe is a bit rocky you don't need that you don't need the pipe to be rocking too much We well, got to do some more observation here. All right, so I got to leave it up for a couple of hours, days, weeks, maybe, hours. and then come out to be. Um, Okay, so that's all for my observation for now. I will keep you posted.